tuning in live once again it's your main man nitty the founder of the bus promotion 614 on the t ohio media tour straight out of cincinnati aka the nasty natty i'm rolling with b luck straight out of tomb studio talk to me what we got cooking up man man we we working man you feel me we at true sound studio my nigga tune dope studio by the way feel me all the real rappers record at true sounds man we don't go nowhere else in the city you know niggas be fans of shit dropping videos showing where you at and all that we, don't, <laughs> we can't do that we still active you don't post no videos of me <laughs> so talk to me about being a number one tackle to to transition into being a rapper man man, well, man what, 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 what's that about hey he just did anything <laughs> listen <laughs> Nah, niggas, everybody grew up playing sports. I ain't gonna lie. We, I played basketball, football, all that. All that shit came second to money. That's what, that's what everything, the, the everything fold in. for me. Yeah, that's how rap is. Like, you know what I'm saying? I love rapping. I love, I do graphics, all that. Everything comes second to money because if you ain't got your bag right, then ain't, ain't nobody trying to worry about you. In fact. You looking good, baby. The ice is shining. But, oh, no, nah, I'm just, I'm just warming up. I just got out of jail. I've been home seven months. <laughs> oh, shit. I've been home seven months. I'm warming up. I, I, you got to stay down sometimes. That's what niggas don't got. Niggas don't be having the dedication to stay down. So talk about what you're trying to bring to the table as an artist. You know, you fighting the, the cases and you, you what, 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 what's, what's holding you back as an artist? Watch man? your mouth. I ain't fighting shit. Listen here, oh, y'all. Okay. I went to prison. That shit over with. Oh, well, he <laughs> it up right here I on the record. I fighting shit. a bitch ass <laughs> thing. Do not put me in the middle of none of that, boy. So I stay. Low. So what's the plan then? Cause you trying to do the rap shit, but you know with the rap shit, it's so easy to get off track with that and just keep that focus. Nah, you feel me? See, it's like in our city, it's like people know who is who. Like it's it's different levels to this shit. And niggas know, like I've been I've been the one around here for a long time. So I it ain't even about me. I'm making sure my niggas get on. You gotta think like we known for more than just rapping here. Like we, right. we got boxing. You feel me? Shout I'm, out to A B. A. Yeah. Runner. So talk feel about me? that connection. You know, cause that, that that's a big connection right there. That's you know. Shout out to K C. Um, K J Jenkins. You know, it's Ohio. Where it's more than just music here. We really nah, got for culture sure. here. For sure. So talk about the difference you trying to make. Your face car obviously good. You moving around this motherfucker. So what is the difference you trying to make? See, I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to bring it to where to the point where. We don't got to worry about going to Atlanta and going to L.A. and living out there. Like, you can really put on from, from the crib. It's niggas that's really doing their thing from the crib, niggas and females. We got Facts. females about to Shout out to through. females out there. You get what I'm saying? So, it's people that's really pushing through from the crib. Like, you don't got to, when you really got the, when you the draw, you don't got to go to nobody else shit. Like, you can go out there to network and be at the important events, but... You can make it from the house. They coming to see you if you got got what they want. Okay, so let me ask you this because I was um I interviewed Rick Flames in Cleveland the other day and he was saying it's a lot of niggas trying to get put on, but not a lot of niggas trying to put niggas on. You sound like a nigga that's trying to help put niggas on. So what you think we lacking as see, a culture we, see, here? See, 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 we gotta we gotta clear that. I'm trying to put my niggas on. Okay, that's the okay. I ain't one of them. We all gotta be good work together. I ain't fuck man. I don't fuck with no niggas, man. I got. I have no friends. I got probably five friends, and them been my niggas for years. Like, I don't give a fuck about all that shit. All that work together, that's fake, because nobody works together nowhere. So, okay, so let, let's get into it, because you coming. I like this. So nah, what, I'm just, Because I'm just, we talking culture, so when niggas' faces is good and niggas trying to do business, and you really trying to help see, move the culture. That's cool. So you got to politic and link in with, tap in with niggas from other places that are on that same level. You don't got to tap in with everybody Are you willing house. to do that, though? That's what yeah, I'm saying. Yeah, for sure. I just got out the joint. I, I ain't go to the joint quiet. I went and took that shit over. And guess right. what? It's niggas from it's <laughs> niggas from all around. <laughs> nah, for sure. Funny. I ain't go to... Boy, ain't nobody ask niggas. Niggas, I wasn't calling home asking for money. I was in there dunking. Cash apps going crazy. I had... 12 phones, all type of shit. Boy, listen, niggas from all around the city, you know, I mean, from around the state for real. Bro. I was linked up with Columbus niggas in there. Bomb Shout squad out niggas. to the city. Shout, Shout out to my nigga Bomber, my nigga Kill Switch, oh, yeah, man. I had real Cleveland niggas. niggas in there. I had Detroit niggas, man. So you got to think, it's a whole, it's a 75, a highway of niggas running back and forth doing crime. So you're going to catch, you get what I'm saying? It's niggas you're in jail from all shit. over. Yeah, you get what right. I'm saying? So for you to be the same nigga you is on the street in jail, you got to really be one of the ones. Because it's niggas that be out here rapping, talking crazy, and go to jail and be quiet as hell, getting beat on and all that shit. Boy, y'all better, y'all could look at all the stories, boy. You ain't gonna find one of them with me. <laughs> so, 
So wait. And I had lean in the joint. He say had lean in the drink in the joint. Listen, man. On bo- on little Boosie's soul, nigga, I had lean in the joint, brother. Like that's what I'm trying to tell you. Like we anywhere we go, we about to, we having like we ain't waiting till somebody come sign us. We is really having shit like. You know what I'm saying, me and Millie, like my niggas pull up, it's gonna be, it might be a million dollars on ice with five of my niggas pulling yeah, up. Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. Like that's ridiculous. Like niggas ain't doing that. Like ain't nobody signed or none of that. Like, so do you want to get out out of? You say you could do it from the crib, but do you want to get out of Cincinnati? Do you want to relocate and you know do something else, or you want to stay here and really do it from the crib? See the thing, like, like, see, I don't be want to talk crazy because it sounds like I'm. It sound like I'm on some rapper shit. Nah, you already shit. talking your I shit. I could really, I could really live where the fuck I want to live okay. right now. You know what I'm okay. saying? Like we okay. really, we are really dunk. Like this, is no exaggeration. Like I could, like what? Well, I can go do this same shit from Dubai. Like it, damn, like, you know, like at this numbers. Point, yeah, at this point, it really don't matter. But it's just like we want to put on for the city. So what better place to do it is from the city. So the city. Earth, so Millie just said it. You know what I'm saying? We don't got like no label here. We don't got no industry here. Let me ask you this. Cause yeah. you talking boss talk. Do you want to start your own label and start signing niggas and playing that type of game? Nah, for sure. I don't care about rapping enough for me to rap. Like, I, I get drop, that vibe. You know what I'm saying? You. Like I drop every few. I want. See, you gotta think. All right, we have a, like a little. It's like a little circle of us with artists in it. So Millie, it's Millie, it's Ar, Cook with Flair. You know what I'm saying? Like we got some of the top rappers that just be in our little circle together. Mm-hmm. So it's like I want to see niggas make it and push through. It, no matter what you're doing, I got niggas here that box that ain't where they need to be in boxing yet. You know what I'm saying? Like, but we got it's people that that, that reach the ultimate level with us. This boxing, we got Javante Davis, we got Adrian Broner, we got Robert. So talk Easter, about that with we got Rashi with, with Warren. Those. Yeah, for like, sure. Like, how far is your hand in that though? As far as the boxing, you you want to? Nah, I'm, I'm for sure. I'm the reason why y'all heard of a lot of people. Like, uh, yeah, I'm the behind the scenes. Like, I did a lot of people's logos, a lot of people's uniforms, a lot of people. The the shit Damn. that they say, the shit that they say in the ring, the I do the marketing promotion, I do all the the countdowns to the fights, all the posters, all that shit you see. What? I do a lot of that shit, but I just don't take credit for it. A real mover and shaker. Yeah, for so sure. So do you got do you got like anything like fashion or anything? What you got cooking up like on the entrepreneur side? Cause you really moving and shaking out here and making a difference. Yeah, so. see, I'm, I'm right now. I'm just trying to put all the pieces back together. You gotta think I was gone for a few years, so it's like. I'm trying to, like, when I came home, I ain't do everything I wanted to do. I had to stay down. I relaxed. For the, I got out of jail in August. The whole year I wore Adidas outfit. I had probably five, six Adidas outfits, and I just trapped them bitches out till I got to where I could put on $800 sweatshirts and $500 hats and all that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't come yeah, out of jail yeah, purple. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. really stayed down. That, that's what you got to do, so. Even with the music, I want to see, I want to see uh, industry here, but all, all that is is uh, five or six artists doing industry shit. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? Like if Eric, if it's more than that, it's gonna be bigger. But all it takes is Eric, if if we had six niggas doing the shit that Millie doing right now, it'll be an industry hit. You're right. In different directions, like so if he uh, he fucking with the IUP niggas, if we had somebody else doing some things in Atlanta, somebody a couple niggas doing going out to LA, like you get what I'm saying, T B doing his thing, Roll Runner T B like Shout out to Roll like Runner. We, it's becoming a it's becoming a, a, a industry here, but we just get it's up to us to build it. What you think that's gonna take though for real on the honest side, like like really what is that gonna take? All though? it take all it take is exposure. Everybody wanna go out of town and buy a booth for five thousand dollars. Everybody wanna go open up for a big rapper and pay two thousand dollars instead of paying a PR. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Getting a pub a, a top publicist or paying to get on the real shit where it's gonna really add traction to your shit and you really get more you ain't paying niggas would rather pay two thousand to get their niggas in the club with their shirts on uh, rather than pay two thousand to get on the top Spotify playlist and get their song Damn. in rotation. You know what I'm saying? Like niggas don't think, bro. Damn, where to put the money? Once you get the money, where you gonna invest the money? Exactly. My niggas is paying thirty six hundred a month to PR people, and it's it's paying off. Like the same thirty six you putting in, you getting back from your streams and your downloads and everything. So it might take a few months, but you, you got to be dedicated to shit. With anything, with anything you doing, you got to be able to sacrifice. That's why I never. That's why I never reached the. The places I needed to reach because I wasn't willing to sacrifice. You get what I'm saying? Mm, that's been you got you got to be broke for a while, yeah. and I ain't doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't, I ain't that's doing real that. Shit though, bro. 
But where can they find you, man? Where can they tap in with the real, man? No, it, they it, know it, what's it, going on with me, support man. what's going on. It's badass luck on everything. Anything you can put it in, it's badass luck, man. You know what the fuck going on. T. Ohio Media Tour. This your main man, Nitty, the founder of the Bus Promotion. This only happens in Ohio. We rolling with the real niggas only. This only happens on Ohio. We gone. Game of Phones out right now, man. Make sure y'all download that. Coming to America 2 will be out soon in May. Fuck with me. Go stream it.